Good morning, boys and girls. So I'm filming at my home, and I miss you guys. I know you're all at home also, and look who is here. Does he look any different to you? Well, you know what happened? Dioji got a bath. So he is so clean. Let's take a look at him. Oh, good morning, Dioji. You're so, oh, it smells so good, boys and girls. Mmm. Will you guys say good morning to Dioji? One, two, three. Good morning, Dioji. Oh, that makes him so happy. Oh, he's just so happy to always be able to talk to you guys. All right, well, I got a story to do for you this morning. So I'm going to have Dioji just chill right over here, okay? And I've got some fun things to do for you today, okay? All right, so I'm gonna do the story. Some of you know the story of Jesus at a wedding and he changes water into wine. So we're, I'll go through the story quickly, but first of all, I want you to see some things. I'm gonna do a little science thingies here. This is not a miracle like Jesus did, but it's just kind of a fun thing to see. So here I have a wine glass and some water. And if this was Jesus, He'd be able to go water into wine. Let's see what happens. <gasps> Very cool, mom and dad. A little rosé. Okay, so that's just a fun little thing. And here's another really fun little thing. So watch this. This is wine. Okay, and I'm going to put it in here. See if I can do this. Fill it up, and this is water. I'm gonna put it in here. Actually, I'm gonna put it down here. And let's see what happens. Watch this. Okay, so here's the water, right? And I put this little clear piece of plastic on it. that happen okay now watch this I'm gonna change the water into wine check it out so this is gonna take a little while <gasps> do you see that see what's happening <gasps> very cool huh all right well I'm gonna get to our story so because it's me, and I don't have all you guys here helping, I'm gonna do this by myself, so I'm gonna be all the characters in our story. So, this story takes place at a wedding, and this will be Jesus. Hello. And this is his mother, Mary. Hello. And this is gonna be a servant at the wedding, okay? So here's what happens. So servant goes up to Mary and says, Mary, we're out of wine. And Mary says, I will go talk to Jesus. So Mary goes, thank you very much. I'm going to go talk to Jesus. So she goes up to Jesus and she says, whoops, Mary. She says, Jesus, we're out of wine. And Jesus says, woman, what do you want me to do about it? It is not my time yet. And then she says, so the servants, servants, do whatever he tells you. And then they go, yes, ma'am. So they go up to Jesus. They go up to Jesus and they go, sir, what should we do? And Jesus looks at them and he says, go and take those jars and fill all six of them full of water. And they go, yes, sir. Okay, that makes no sense to them, but they obey him and they leave and they take, these jars are huge, boys and girls. The Bible says that they're 20 to 30 gallons each. Okay, so I'm gonna show you what that looks like. So boys and girls, here's three gallons of water. And so 20 to 30, 30 gallons would be close to filling this whole 
big trash can. I mean, it's pretty big. Okay, so here's my dog, Seikos. He's next to it, and he's 83-pound dog. So you can see how much water they had to get to fill six of these. Um, this would almost be full. Six whole of these trash cans. And these are the jars that Jesus told them to go fill with water. It's a lot of water. All right. So you can see how much that was. So what happens is they bring it back to the wedding and Jesus says to, to people at the wedding, he says, go and take out of those jars. It will be wine. And sure enough, they go and they dip into those big jars and they drink it and they're like, oh, this is like the best wine we've ever had. And the man who was running the wedding, he went up to, G to Jesus and was like, how come you saved the best wine for last? Because that's how good it was. So boys and girls, when Jesus does things, he does it the right way and he does it well. So this is called a miracle. And a miracle is something that cannot be explained with nature or science or anything. And it is done by God. And the Bible says that th this was probably Jesus' first miracle that he did. And he did many. And he did it listening to his Father in heaven. He was able to perform that miracle. Is that cool? So boys and girls, I want you to look around and everything we see outside, God created, and all of it is a miracle, and so are you, and so am I. Thank you, Jesus. Do you see this? Look what just happened. Do you see how now this is becoming the water and this is becoming the wine? Isn't that cool? That's not a miracle. It's just a little science trick. Okay, boys and girls, love you, and I'll talk to you next week. Say, God does miracles. Good job. Say, he's the way maker and miracle worker. The way maker and miracle worker. All right, talk to you next time. Love you.